Owner of New Age Wildlife Art, Dustin Harry, said he got into taxidermy because of his love of the outdoors. Into taxidermy for the love of the outdoors, pretty much, to be honest with you. Um, it's always something that I've grew up doing, and it was always something that I uh, enjoyed being around. I first started taxidermy when I was 15 years old, working with a local taxidermist here in Grand Island, and um, I felt as if it was something that I always wanted to do, and I ended up going to school, Northwest School of Taxidermy in Iowa, and kind of picked it up from there and was privileged enough to go work with some professional taxidermists uh, in the industry who were highly skilled, had a lot of skill set, and was intrigued with what they had done and what they were able to teach me. And it kind of just led me to want to share that with all the customers that I have and, and let people know that there is some quality stuff out there. There's several people that do some quality things. I look to be one of those uh, as far as like what my competitors do and just with a different twist. I kind of want to make sure you never have to clean it. You never have to, uh, never have to worry about it causing any problems with odor or anything of that nature and um, make sure it'll last a lifetime. Harry thinks that people want taxidermy to preserve their hunt. I believe that if somebody was going to get something done in taxidermy, it's going to be due to preserving their hunt. They want to be able to have some, some form of preservation of the trophies they had, the experience they had with the hunting partners that they were with, or their hunting companion, whether it be their dog, best friend, uh, wife, girlfriend, whatever it would be. I believe that would be the, the reason that a lot of people would enjoy to have taxidermy done and gives them something to always look back and cherish the moments. You know, Good times can be had by all and taxidermy just kind of allows that to uh, stick around for a while. Harry has a concept that sets him apart from most taxidermists. He encloses his taxidermy in a wooden glass case to create a one-of-a-kind piece. The case concept and closing everything in glass, primarily the principle was the preservation to give it and put it in, in behind glass so that you don't have to worry about five years down the road looking at it and saying, God, that thing is dirty. I don't know what the heck to do about it. Well, and you put it behind glass, you do a water scene, you do something interesting with um, the scenery and the habitat around there. Snow tends to collect a lot of dust. Water scenes tend to collect a lot of dust. The birds itself tend to collect a lot of dust. And um, if you put it behind glass, you don't have to worry about any of that. The photographs, I always wanted to incorporate my vision of what that hunt was so that I could explain it to somebody that's never experienced it. Um, you sit in a room full of people and you're talking about hunting stories or fishing stories. They always sound intriguing, but it's really hard to visualize what that person went through to get the trophy that they have based off what they tell them. Unless you have a visual interpretation to go along with it, it makes it extremely difficult to have an understanding of what that person went through to get the trophy that they, they acquired throughout their trip, hunting excursion, whatever it may be, trip to Canada, fishing trip. Um, I don't feel like people get the best understanding of it just by somebody talking about it because there's so many little details that uh, you can't always remember but sometimes a photograph will help you to capture some of the small details and remember parts of the story that you might have forgotten along the way. For somebody to, to get re receive one of these you can either we can go in and we can find out if you want to customize your entire basement like some of the customers that I have had. If you want to customize a case to your individual space that you have all of that can be done and it all can be arranged and the prices will be according to what arrangements can be made and how it has to be done so that you can have what you want. Um, there's nothing that says that there's anything that can't be done. I mean we can work around whatever it is. If you have a, a cabinet or something there that's already there and you want to enhance that or do something like that, we can be that can be done. Given the taking the time and the time to take to time to do it and the time that it takes to get everything done. We can, uh, we can make it work for just about any situation. New Age Wildlife Art is a Grand Island business. Find out more about the work Dustin does at newagewildlifeart.com. Reporting in Grand Island, I'm Zach Mayhew.